guys, what's up? It's the Fun Clash here. Subscriber base review number three or two, I do not remember. But uh, yeah, so thank you for tuning in. Let's get right into this. So um, I have recently created a Twitter for the Fun Clasher. Um, if you have a Twitter and would like to follow it, get all up to date news about the Fun Clasher and when videos are coming out. Um, yeah, just follow at F, capital F, A, L, L, E, N, C, capital C, L, A, S, H, E, R, at Fallen Clasher. I couldn't do the Fallen Clasher because it was too many characters, but yeah. Um, so I tweeted saying that there was a subscriber base review today, and, uh, everybody tweeted me back saying, uh, their clan and their in-game name. So, uh, yeah, let's get into this. Uh, this is a Town Hall 8. Uh, I would recommend definitely trying to centralize that mortar on the right, but a uh, great job centralizing the clan castle. Um, also, uh, I'm not sh really sure where you could put that mortar. It's kind of difficult. I would recommend kind of switching up your base a little. Maybe uh, copying someone on YouTube, just... Uh, uh, YouTube, like, Town Hall 8 farming design, so something like that, yeah. Um, also, trying to centralize that, uh, wizard tower on the bottom. I know it is difficult, but, uh, you will eventually find a base that will centralize mortars and wizard towers and a clan castle, uh, which is always good. Um, now I'm just trying to figure out kind of, like, where you could put stuff, but... I've now concluded that uh, you have to change your base to be able to centralize those other splash defenses. Um, you could swap or move the Barbarian King over and then put another compartment around him with uh, those walls on the left by that laboratory and the walls up top by that Dark Elixir drill. Uh, those would be some good ideas. Um, yeah, but well upgraded walls. I'll give you that well upgraded uh mortars. Just keep working on those and uh yes, let's get into the next one. So um I did make a Twitter and it's the first Twitter I've ever had. So I'm kind of trying to get used to it. Um and that kind of stuff. So uh, people have helped me along, uh, up to 30 followers, so if you guys do have a Twitter and you care about my channel, you definitely want to follow me. Um, here I'm just trying to find this guy, I forget what his name was, I think it was like, Steven? No, that was the other guy, Sir Meeks, yeah, that, that's, this is the guy. Um, he does have a Town Hall 5. This is a very good Town Hall 5 trophy base. Um, the, uh, it's kind of destroyed, but the Wizard Tower you see are right there, and the Mortars are there. Uh, there are Elixir Collectors on the right side, and there are Gold Mines on the left side, and Barracks and stuff. Um, you actually might want to swap out, I'm just thinking about this, that Air Defense with uh, your clan castle because nobody really attacks with air stuff at 1200 trophies but your decision your call uh, if you did want to make this into a farming base just swap out the air defense with the gold storage and the town hall with the gold storage and uh, kind of move those walls in from the archer towers uh, yeah that would be a good idea uh, but yeah all in all very good Trophy hunting base. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Little interruption. Got interrupted. So, uh, here's the next base. Um, sorry about all the low levels in this, uh, subscriber base review. Um, but if you guys are high level and you want to see some high level bases, sorry about that. I'll make sure to do a Town Hall 9 and a Town Hall 10. Uh, subscriber base review in the next subscriber base review so uh, yeah here's a town hall 7 very good 
uh, well upgraded. Um, very good that you centralized this clan castle. Very good that you centralized the mortars, and very good that you centralized the wizard towers. Yes, that's what they're called. Um, you could definitely swap out that barbarian king for the archer tower, that level eight archer tower. Either one doesn't really matter, but uh. And then use those walls that are by those upgrading arch towers uh, to make another compartment around that barbarian king or the level 8 arch tower, whatever you choose to put there. But uh, yeah, that was a very good Town Hall 7 farming base. We are getting a lot of good bases though, um, so that is good for all the low level subscribers of mine. Um, here, I can't find this guy. He says he's in Tribes of the North, but it's either I'm blind or he's not in this clan. Uh, it's mostly, it's most likely that he's not in this clan because I do have 20-20 vision. Um, that's just a side note, but yeah, he's not in this clan. So uh, I try and I do find somebody else in this thing. Um, so make sure I will send out a tweet when I do my next subscriber base review to uh, comment to your clan first, your in-game name, your level third, and then your uh, town hall level fourth. Because um, then I will be able to search through them and see the high levels. And yes, yeah, so now I give up on trying to find that guy and uh, look. For our next subscriber, um, he's not in this one, but he is in this one. He is a Town Hall 7, he said. Uh, where is he? Right there, Merlin. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so, he is Town Hall 7. Not well upgraded. He needs to upgrade his mortars, his wizard towers and his walls and a lot of things so make sure you do max everything before you upgrade your town hall again because that is the smartest thing to do i have learned that over one year of clash of clans but uh yes uh here i'm just kind of clicking around i don't even know what i'm doing um upgrade those air defenses as you are doing um, keep doing those because air defenses are vital once you get up in the trophy count. Um, uh, you might want to move those walls and make another compartment around that Barbarian King. Because then the more compartments, the better, because then troops will get distracted and then they have to do go through another layers, another layer of walls. Um, yeah. Here, what's this guy's name? Sean. Yes, this is Sean. So, um, this base, um, needs a lot of upgrading. Sorry to say, Sean, but you're gonna want to look up a Town Hall 5, uh, farming base or a trophy hunting base, whatever you want to on the internet. There's plenty of them. Um, and work on upgrading. A lot of your defenses and walls and all of that good stuff because that will make you better at the game. Um, some guy just left my clan with sexy in his name, I don't even know. But, um, so let's go on the attack at 1600 trophies. Been finding a lot of good attacks here. Uh, with a lot of gold, it's not too many low-level town halls. We just we just had one, but there is for all my new subscribers. I am town hall nine, currently farming to try and get to town hall ten. Um, yeah, so go right into the attack. Gonna go for the three star because I want to, because it's fun three starring people. And this guy's kind of inactive, so some of it is going to be in the collectors, and I can tell that because there are tombstones, 
and therefore if they're tombstones uh, that usually means usually that uh, there is no clan castle troops um, of course there's lag right when, right when I deploy every single troop but um, I usually like to overkill some bases like I don't really ever three star town hall nines Usually just Town Hall 8s and 7s, of course, but, um, sometimes I'll just be nice and just take their resources, but not take, like, 30 trophies, but sometimes I'm just in the mood to get a 3-star to show my power. So, um, that's what I did here, but we're wrapping up. Level 11 Barbarian King. And, uh, yeah, guys, so thank you for watching. Make sure you follow me on Twitter at... Fallen Clasher, um, and make sure you do subscribe if you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more content, and uh, make sure you drop a like if you did like it, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.